Hello and welcome to the review of the DVD Home Cinema System from LG. Again I'd like to thank AO.com for giving us this prize in a competition run on Facebook that my wife Stephanie won. The device itself has a nice sleek black finish which looks great in any cabinet or as a standalone piece on the, on the side. The remote is a good size with the buttons pretty clear. The main left and right speakers a very elegant stand type upright tall speakers. They're about two and a half, three foot in height. The system also comes with a powerful subwoofer. I have placed it behind my telly as we're a bit restricted for space where we have our setup. It probably would look better out the front but unfortunately due to space restrictions it will fit because it is quite big. The system comes with a, a bar type central speaker again because of space restrictions we've had to put this behind the telly it's not a problem this sound is still very audible from this position but again this would be better around the front of the unit. The system also has two satellite speakers which we've put in our case probably about 10 foot from the telly and um, behind the sofa on a small table to the left and the other speaker over on the right is in a small unit just next to the sofa behind this is about the right kind of spacing for the satellite speakers and um, the cable easily reached this far i'd say this right speaker is heading on 12 to 14 feet from the from the television the system uses a digital display to, down, to show you what mode you're in and what the volume settings are current setting is USB there's an auxiliary mode to which I have an external sound system well, an external sound source plugged in um, unfortunately it's just the left and right input for this auxiliary input not digital which is a bit of a shame but the sound's still really good um, portable I think that's just the, another device you can plug in I'm not too sure to be honest what that is um, it has a radio and then there's a DVD setting and then back to USB the system is a front loaded tray you insert your DVD or CD onto the um, platter and head in. The front panel falls forward to allow this, which is, is quite nice, it looks quite good. The sticker on the front shows some of the formats it can accept, which is just DVD, not Blu-ray, DivX, which is obviously the digital video format, um, and USB standard video. You can insert a USB stick into it and play videos from that. Um, the full HD upscaling, you connect via a HDMI cable, even though it's not high definition, it does a pretty good job of upscaling a standard DVD. But again, unfortunately, don't forget this is not a Blu-ray device, it is just a DVD player. But it's probably one of the better ones on the market. <laughs> Round the back, all those wires there at the back of the picture. They're all the satellite speakers, central speaker and subwoofers, the big orange one. Really easy to set up. Just trying to keep control of all the wires is a bit of a pain because they are quite um, quite long and to be fair it's it's not too bad at all. There's the aerial for the radio. And back here is the auxiliary input and the HDMI port out. So this is the home screen for the DVD home menu. When you've not got a disc in, this is what you get. You can select, obviously, music, movie, photo setup, because you might have a USB device plugged in. But when you insert the disc, which I'll do now, it automatically detects what you're doing. Put that in. Oops. So it's reading the disc there. Recognises it's a DVD, shows you me in the reflection of the screen. 
and there you can see it's loaded with DVD and the picture quality is pretty good for an upscale um, let's load up oh there's the DVD protection so I probably shouldn't really be showing you this because it's probably in breach of that but never mind Sure, they'll understand. Uh, it's running <laughs> stimpy. Um, so, yeah, I'll set that going. Pretty standard um, remote with all the standard DVD buttons play, start, pause, forward, backwards. Nice big volume in the middle there with a the mute and a record button. Um, there's the home button. If you press that anytime, it'll go straight back to the home menu obviously I don't know if it's going to focus there's a disc menu just to the right of that as well which will go back to the first menu of the DVD you navigate using those arrow buttons in the, in the middle and um, it goes pretty loud and it sounds really really good going through all the, all the different speakers around behind me and stuff So uh, that's a bit of interesting for you, and that's a DVD playing. So yeah, I'm really happy with it. It's really good. So thanks for pausing and watching your uh, watching this lovely review of this DVD home cinema system from LG. Um, it's a great little system. Um, if I was purchasing one, I'd probably go for the uh, the um, Blu-ray option rather than DVD. But as far as DVDs go. Um, it really does do a nice nice job of both sound and picture with the upscaling. So I'll let the unit say what I would normally say. <laughs>